Super Coin Crew here, where it's non-stop Nintendo with a huge Splatoon update, plus more Miitomo news. My name is Cade, and I'm Nikki, and on the channel, we put up an awesome Splatoon review of this guy. Ah, he's so cute and so fat and chubby. And we also did this awesome list of our top 10 favorite Super Mario enemies, as well as this week, we're going to talk about why you should play Super Mario Maker. I know, and everyone should be playing that game, absolutely one of the best for the Wii U. And also tomorrow is 107 facts about Pikmin. Oh. But also tonight yeah. is Tell me. Splatoon Update. Oh, no, I'm so excited. So we're gonna be getting Sheldon's picks, right? Mm -hmm. This is volume one. Volume one, and we already have eight weapons. Eight weapons look so crazy to me. And they all look like completely new, revamped, and like really fresh. And it's crazy because Splatoon Tumblr posted that awesome graphic of all the weapons mm -hmm. being held by Inkling, yeah. like, this is it. That's the, that's the end of the book. Right. Right. 76. Awesome. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> and like, here's eight more. <laughs> so I'm grateful for that. Yeah, I know. I'm really surprised that they're doing it. I mean, and again, this is just volume one yeah. with eight new weapons. Like, wow, the roster could be breaking 100. Yeah, so the 2.7 update is coming tonight, mm -hmm. April 12th, 7 p.m. Pacific time. That's right. And we have eight weapons, and we're going to run through them. Mm -hmm. First on the list is the Wasabi Splatter Shot. I love this, right? It comes with an Ink Strike and Splat Bombs, which I love the Splatter Shot as it is, but throwing an Ink Strike in there, that's one of my favorite specials. Exactly, because mm -hmm. currently it was only the Ink Zuka mm -hmm. or the Bomb Rush. First bomb, bomb rush. Yep, first bomb, yep. We got the Berry Splatter Shot Pro, which comes with a Suction Bob sub weapon mm -hmm. and a Bomb Rush Special, and that's interesting. Yeah, I don't really use the Splatter Shot Pro too much, but uh, I like, like, again, they all look so new and really fresh, and the color scheme is really cool. All the colors, all, all of them are great. Yeah. We have the fresh Squiffer that comes with a Suction Bomb and a Kraken Special, mm -hmm. and the other two Squiffers have either a Bubbler or Ink Zuka Special, so this is the first time that a Squiffer is getting a Kraken. All you Squiffer mains out there, this is you. You also got the permanent ink brush, which comes with splat bombs and the Kraken, which, by the way, the only other brush that has Kraken is the Octobrush. Correct. This is easily the best name out of the eight new weapons, the Soda Slosher. Love it, love it. It comes with splat bombs for its sub weapon and an ink zooka for its special, and the first slosher with an ink zooka. Oh, really? You know, that, oh. the slosher machines, the sloshers, the tri right. sloshers, okay, none right. of them have an ink zooka. Also, the Bamboozer 14 MK3 comes with burst bombs and an ink strike. Pretty standard set there. Yeah, and the MK1 came with a splash ball, and the MK2 came with a disruptor, which are both kind of defensive weapons. Mm -hmm. So it's interesting that this one came with a burst bomb, because a lot of snipers love that burst bomb with damage up. Yeah, know? anytime I see a charger with burst bombs, I'm just like, all right, I'm out of here. <laughs> We're also getting a really snazzy looking Dynamo Roller. It's called yeah. a Tempered Dynamo Roller. It looks really, really cool. I like it a lot. Coming with a Seeker Sub and a Killer Whale Special, which is pretty cool. I'm a big fan of the Dynamo Rollers. Last but not least is actually not something that's brand new, but it's actually refurbished. The refurbished mini splatling, which I thought was a kind of a funny name. Um, it's coming with the burst bomb and of course a bomb rush, which is pretty handy. I love the color scheme for this. It's white and orange. Mm -hmm. And it's interesting that you got the burst bomb rush because a lot of splatlings come with, you know, bubble specials. Yeah. But I'm excited to use this one. I love the heavy splatling, but yeah. I'm interested in using this mini splatling. Well, the mini splatling, the thing about it is, like, since it's, such, it's a charge weapon, right? The burst bomb and the bomb rush is great for close range combat. If you're partnering that up with the mini splatling, you know, that's that seems like a good couple right there. Yeah, because you know, have to charge your shot with splatling. Exactly. And, you know, when you're really close, you can't really single tap. ZR really quickly, yep. so the burst bombs will come in handy. A mm -hmm. couple of things we wanted to note, especially this, is that your respawn special gauge usually decreases at 50%, you know, whenever you get splatted and you yeah. come back. However, this has been changed depending on the weapon. Yeah, so it can actually be less or more depending on what weapon you're using in battle. Yeah, which is crazy to me. A couple of the major changes, Dynamos, E-Leaders, Hydra Splatlings have a 10% decrease in swim speed. Yeah. So your mobility is going down. But there are a lot of awesome perks to some of my favorite weapons that mm -hmm. I wanted to share with you. And this is just some that we picked out. Yeah, just a couple that we noticed that we were like, hey, wow, that's pretty interesting for us. Yeah, the splash o -Matic and the neo splash o -Matic is getting a 10% increase in velocity, range, and spread, which is crazy. They've also increased the fire rate for the Slosher and the Slosher Deco by 20%. So, you know, when you're yeah. 20% faster. This is one of my favorite updates, is that the Carbon Roller and the Carbon Roller Deco, yep. there's gonna be a 30% decrease in the ink consumption when flinging ink. That's insane. That is so crazy to me because those weapons are already pretty powerful. Yeah. And so like adding this on top of it, I'm like, wow. Jet Squelcher and Custom Jet Squelcher have gotten a 50% increase on speed while shooting. Those are just some of the changes that they're making to weapons, but the update will also include changes to sub-weapons, maps like Salt Spray Rig, 
Bluefin Depot, Flounder Heights, yeah, and also online battle issues as well. So another great reason to pick up Splatoon today, if you haven't done it already, what are you doing? And if you haven't been playing lately, pick it up again, start playing, and use Sheldon's picks, because we got eight new weapons, man. This is just volume one. Volume one. Okay, moving on to Miitomo. Listen, in four days, in four days here in the U.S., Miitomo has been downloaded by 1.6 million people. Wow. I know. In the first four days? Yes. I feel like that beats out Japan. Maybe. I don't know. I'd have to look at the numbers, but that's just crazy. I mean, there's over 3 million active users. Collectively, yeah. Yeah, collectively. Worldwide. If you haven't seen it already, the game drop has updated the prize pool, and if you missed out on your cat companion, you can still suit up in ninja gear for both men and women, and of course, there's a tree costume. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> so you got this awesome, like, ninja gear, which is available in multiple colors, mm -hmm. and there's also, like, the stylish version. It's like, oh, you don't have to get the full body suit. You yep. get a shuriken tee, a, mm -hmm. a kanji tee, yep. and actually, Again, you gotta check your shop every day because there's That's new right. items. Mm -hmm. uh, they added a few cowboy. Oh, yeah, yeah they items. added the cowboy stuff, right? Yeah, and a mohawk. You can get a mohawk. Yeah, mm -hmm. and daily, though, I ran into two kanji tees. It was oh, like the love kanji. But and it's a I, different one, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's not the one that you can get in the in game, game drop. Yeah. yeah, and I thought that was pretty cool. Mm. And in addition to that, a little tip that I found out uh -oh. recently. Uh -huh. Usually, they'll have like an outfit preset, like, oh, wear all these things. Mm -hmm. And I noticed like, hey, I don't have that hoodie in my shop. Oh, okay. So, I, I'm like, I don't want oh, the full is, outfit. Yeah, that's a good tip. That's a good tip, yeah. So, you wear it and you go to checkout and then you uncheck the items you don't want. Yeah. Like, I only want the yeah. headphones. Yes, or like that gray rain jacket. Yeah, exactly. Right. So that's another way to get like exclusive items to that day right. without buying the whole thing. Yeah, that's a that's a great note actually because I mean a lot of times the outfits are like the princess set or something yeah. like that. I'm just like I don't really want that. But like if I wanted the tiara, yeah. I could just get the exactly. tiara. Which I want the tiara. Exactly. <laughs> so again, the Mitomo drop update is complete with shoes, hood, and even multiple swords, like different colors of the yeah. swords and stuff like that. So I thought that was pretty cool. So I got the white sword. I managed to get it. I got the white sword and the full pink ninja outfit. Did you Did you get the white sword? Because why? Did you get the white sword? I saw you got it. So I got it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so out with the cats in the garden and in with the ninja and the bread is still there But that's gonna be out the door soon, too So I'm looking forward to seeing like what new game and what new gear they're gonna give us Sheldon's picks <laughs> Sheldon's picks Mitomo. Mitomo. Volume No, I mean a. that would be so sick if there's like a Legend of Zelda themed uh, Mitomo drop where you have to get like all the tunic pieces or like all the weapons or yeah. something like that I I need to start getting those gold points because I saw that it's only 90 mm -hmm. and 90 gold points you can buy Super Mario 64 for the Wii U I'll just buy a game. Yeah, you have to buy a game, and then yeah. you'll get credit to buy another well, game. Well, yeah, like, if you're buying a game anyway, you know, I'm like, yeah, it's like two for one, kind of. Yeah. It's kind of like two for one. It's like, buy this game, get this game. That's one thing that I wanted to mention was make sure you're logging into my Nintendo every week, you're logging onto the eShop every week, and you're also checking Miiverse every single week because you're going to get bonuses. Yeah, we did a total breakdown on our last update about Miitomo tips and tricks. <laughs> definitely check that out if you haven't already, and definitely pick up Splatoon if you're not playing because <laughs> Sheldon picks tonight, April 12th, 7 p.m. PST. I know what I'm doing tonight and tomorrow and the next day and the next <laughs> day. I'm playing Splatoon. And I'll do a couple of game drops. Absolutely. For Mitomo. Yeah. Absolutely. Splatoon and Mitomo all the time. Right here on Super Coin Crew, it is nonstop Nintendo. So be sure to check out all of our videos right here on the channel. And if you haven't already, join the coin and subscribe. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching.